Hello class, I'm Dr. Mark Rajai. Today we are going to discuss the topic of origin of engineering practice, function of management, what exactly engineering management is and the need for engineers in management. Please listen to the PowerPoint presentation that follows and I will come back at the end and highlight the key points of the topic. Managing Engineering and Technology 5th edition by Morse and Babcock Managing engineering and technology is divided into three categories. Management functions Managing technology And personal technology Management functions is further subgrouped into Planning, decision making, organizing, controlling and leading. Managing technology is subgrouped into research, design, planning production, managing production, marketing, and project management. Personal technology is divided into ethics, career, diversity, time management, and global. Engineering and Management Chapter 1 Chapter Objectives This chapter objective is to Describe the origins of engineering practice. Identify the functions of management. Explain what is engineering management. And explain the need for engineers in management. What do engineers do? Following are the management definitions. Organizational or administrative process. Group running and organization and occupational career management levels first line managers middle managers and top managers Mintzberg published 10 management roles in his book which are then divided into three categories they are interpersonal informational and decisional following roles comes under interpersonal category figurehead leader and liaison informational category has monitor disseminator and spokesperson decisional category has Entrepreneurial Disturbance Handler Resource Allocator and Negotiator Fayal's five primary functions of management are as follows Planning Organizing Commanding Coordinating and Controlling Kuntz published five management functions, and they are Planning Organizing Staffing Leading And controlling Engineering management Engineering management is, the direct supervision of engineers, or engineering functions, or Application of quantifiable methods and techniques to practice management. According to Babcock, engineering managers are distinguished from other managers because they possess both the ability to apply engineering principles and skill in organizing and directing people and projects. In the PowerPoint that you just watched, we discussed the origins of engineering and different types of management level. Keep in mind that vast number of engineers enters into engineering managerial position at some point in their life. It is important that you should understand what is the basic definition of engineering management.